gives you somebody encourages somebody let's go with the five declarations okay so daniel chapter five a little bit of context so here we have a new king his name is king belshazzar he takes over after king nebuchadnezzar dies so i'm assuming that there's time lapse in these reigns so you don't go through one chapter like a year later there's a, there's a time like lead time between or even like i don't know centuries i don't know i don't know i'm just assuming between the the time where a particular king reigns and another king comes through so never read the bible in context ha oh, king never gets was a king now 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 is this guy no this, maybe there was a time lapse uh, behind that so obviously he dies and then he receives a, the king belshazzar uh is all it's all party and it's gumnandi guys gumnandi in english means it's it's popping you know he's having parties he's enjoying himself and then all of a sudden he sees the writings on the walls and he is startled and then just like king nebuchadnezzar he looks for somebody to give him interpretation of what this means he tries astrologers i guess there wasn't a handover with king nebuchadnezzar he tries the mediums he tries all these earthly so-called foreseers nothing and then his mom says hmm there's a guy who actually is known for his knowledge and wisdom which comes from the gods of heaven maybe it's worth reaching out to him so they quickly get to daniel and then the king is like dude if you give me an interpretation of this dream i will put robes on you i will make you this i will make you chief of this 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 daniel is like uh -uh, keep your gifts i don't need your gifts but i can help you with the interpretation of your dreams so daniel again guys daniel is like a g he's so chilled he is so he knows who he is in christ in god he knows who he is he doesn't need uh, uh, uh what you call this to be puffed up or to be given presents and all these other things that normally people will be more than happy to take like oh, okay you're gonna give me a ride okay sure i'm gonna help you so again this the book of daniel teaches us how according to the commentary that i was reading from dr tony evans uh, bible commentary it teaches how it teaches believers how to live in a pagan society under pagan rules but also using the kingdom uh rules to govern us as we live so never fold to the systems of this world okay so daniel obviously gets to the king and then he tells him what the dream means the king is like oh wow you know it's amazing as always and then um yeah so i don't want to go through the whole chapter again i would recommend you to read the book of daniel study the book of daniel I've studied the book of Daniel probably several times now and it still gets to me. It still gets to me. But the more I read it, the more revelation I also receive. So let's go with the declarations. I declare that I'll be sought after like Daniel was after after all kings. I declare that I'll be known for exceptional ability and divine knowledge and understanding. I declare that I am a child of God. He gives me wisdom to solve difficult problems i declare like daniel i will provide help where needed but not accept gifts as the wisdom comes from the lord i declare that high officials who's who who ooh, okay who have been puffed up with arrogance like king like the king what was i saying here Okay, I think this was for yesterday, so excuse me for that. So let's go on. I declare that the Most High God rules over the kingdom of the world and appoints who he desires. So those are the declarations for today. Read the book of Daniel and study it if you can. So that is all for today. I pray that God keeps you. I pray that his light shines up you, shines upon you and your family and your friends and your loved ones and whoever is in your circle. And I pray that you remain steadfast in your integrity.